one of the things about composing that is really important for not just compose for any creative being, having the right environment, having the right environment that you can actually feel, that you can actually release, and let things, what I believe, come to you. Instead of you going out chasing you, if we sit quiet and we have the right environment, you can sit back and so many things you hear, so many things you observe, or so many things you feel. This weekend, I have an opportunity, which is a rare opportunity. I have the house to myself, which is um, which is a rarity, which is um, uh, because I don't have the house to myself. I have to go to other places to record or actually to feel these things so I can hear these vibrations, which I believe that we're all in tune to. Creative people are in the vibrations, and we hear things, and we feel things. I'm no, and I believe that this is instilled in every one of us, not just the people who maybe we hear about composing, performing, or writing, or doing certain things. I believe we all have this inside of us. We just sit back and just listen. The universe speaks to us. You have to be quiet enough to hear it. I don't think the music I do is any different. I don't think some of the music, we're just all wired a certain way to hear certain frequencies. And the music that I come up with is writing music that I hear in certain frequencies that I are innate to me. That may not be picked up by other people. And some people may pick up some of the frequencies, but maybe I picked them up first, or depending on the se depending on the sequences, things that go around. I believe the sounds go around and they come back around, and, and the frequencies. And people who are, are wired to hear those things will hear them and feel them. And some people may be inspired enough to do something with those sounds and to come up with something different.